We're on to you, Taco Bell. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. The internet loves Taco Bell. And how do we know that? Well, we live inside the internet and we see all. Yes, we do. Taco Bell, not a sponsor, offers a solid, reliable fast food experience. But is it too reliable? Hmm. You see, there are theories floating around on the internet where we live that everything on Taco Bell's menu basically tastes the exact same. That it's all just one set of flavors being reconfigured into different shapes and delivery mechanisms. And today, we're putting that to the test. It's time for, it's taco time! Or is it burrito time? Or maybe it's quesadilla time? I can't tell what time it is! Somebody help me! Rhett, it's okay. You're you're on the set of GMM, everything's fine, and, and I'm here to help oh, you. Yeah. yeah. Thank yeah, God. Worked up. Because as you can see, we can't. <laughs> Hi, I'm glad you still worked that in. Yeah. <laughs> Gentlemen, you are moments away from conducting a series of blind taste tests. Now, throughout today's taste tests, you may ask for a second bite by ringing the bells in front of you because you get it? Taco Bell. And those are ah! bells. Um, yes. And then a second bite will be put in your mouth because you okay. can't be feeding yourself this, okay, yes. this episode. I'll tell you, I smell Taco Bell, and that's all I can say because it all smells the same. Yeah, we've definitely had, we, we've had this theory, we've had this conversation many times. I'm Is glad to hear that we're not the only ones, but now we prove it or disprove it, not a sponsor. Okay, so before this first round, I need you to answer the following question. The, uh, 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 on, on weekends? Of these four Taco Bell menu items, which is your favorite? One, Crunch Wrap Supreme. Two, Nacho Cheese Doritos Locos Tacos Supreme. Ooh, that's good. Three, Nachos Bel Grande. Aye. Or four, Mexican Pizza. Oh, I gotta go and listen. I love Christy, and she loves the Mexican pizza. Her life stopped. When it went away, and it started when it came back. But do you like it, or are you just gonna go with it? And then it like hers? stopped when it went away again. Or because they all taste the same, and it doesn't matter. What? Are you gonna pick it because I you picked like, it? You like it, or because she likes it? She likes it. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go with B, not only because I said that as a joke before you even asked the question, but it actually is my answer. The the Doritos. Nacho taco. cheese Doritos yeah. Locos. Okay. Okay, cool. So the do? reason I asked you okay. is because in this round, we are removing the element of shape and form completely from these items. We took all of them and we slap chopped them into little bits, bits huh. you'll be eating You're gonna blindly. Love my nuts. Did you use it? Dish by dish. Personally, no. <laughs> but yes, we did in general. Um, and you're going to taste these four dishes in no particular order. And then I'm going to ask you, which one is the favorite? The oh, item that you yeah. oh, so we identified the thing that we just said we thought yep. we liked. Yep, yep, yep. So here we go with number one. Okay. I think I know what that is. Okay. Here's I, the I, second I one. Where the choices are. Okay. Is he getting the same things well, I'm getting what, right now? You don't know your choices? I, what am, I, you're, you're just finding your favorite one. Oh, you're, trying to find the th you're trying to find a Mexican pizza. I'm trying to find the Doritos Locos. Oh, I've, ne I've never had a Mexican pizza. Yeah that's, <laughs> yeah, that's why I said, are you saying that because it's what well, she what, likes or what you like? Because and, that's and, going and, to impact And things. what did I say? I said what she likes. And I was just like, he's Link. You can't help the boy sometimes. When, when you... <laughs> you're your own worst enemy, oh, man. Oh, my... Okay. You've never had other, a Mexican pizza? What are the uh, never. What are the other two choices? Um There are four there's, there's all the there same four choices. There's three more choices because she said four things. The chicken quesadilla is my favorite thing. I didn't it's not say a choice. the chicken quesadilla. But that's my favorite thing. It's not one of that's the choices not the though. Point. Link, have you had a Mexican pizza before? No. I said no. No. <laughs> you have not. I've had the Doritos logo. Okay, why don't taco, you try to find the Doritos? Not the Supreme, because it has tomatoes. Well, we've taken the tomatoes out of all your Okay, I'll go things. with the Doritos. Okay, uh, so you're looking for the same thing now, the thing that you've both had. Yep. And you've uh, you've oh. tried one okay. item. Okay. And now we're moving to the second item. Oh. <laughs> okay, I think I know what that was. Okay, number three. Oh, Link's still chewing. 
Give it to me anyway. God. <laughs> Please feed me. Hmm. Okay. All right. We're going to move on to four. Yes. Hmm. Really? <laughs> okay. Two of these are the same. Exactly the same. Okay, I a think a third I'm one is almost the same and then a, another one is totally different. <clears throat> okay, now you've you've you're you've picked the same thing that you're guessing. So I'm going to give you a 3 2 1. Okay, here you go. 3 2 1 3. three. That 100% was 100% sure. If I would have known can I put my I would have done. Up? Okay, so yeah, you can take your blindfold well, yeah, off. Yeah, because so, we did. That, I mean, because of the because of the Dorito shell and the and the beef. But four. Uh. Uh-uh. Uh. We don't know if we're right. Four. Which was the four one? And one. Um, okay, I can link. tell you what all of them were. Four oh, and great. one are the same thing, and three was almost that plus beans. Okay. You think four and one two. are the same? <laughs> four and one are the same thing, and two is that plus beans. Okay. The first one was the Mexican pizza. The second one was the Crunch Rat Supreme. The third one was the uh, Doritos, and the fourth one was the nachos. Correct. Boom! I'm a Taco Bell genius. Okay. I mean, and we have those items. You just said them so quickly, we couldn't get them out. But it's interesting what we're learning in this round because Link just said two of them were the same, and one of them was the same with beans, and yet Rhett identified every single one. So we're we're splitsies. Hey, Taco Bell's very Oh, there's nuanced. beans on nuance. This is not beans on the Oh good. <laughs> Taco Bell <laughs> already have. Yeah. They got you you got them. I mean, okay, I'll give it to you, man. Cuz this right, this is the only thing that helped me. Was this was just the Dorito, It was the, the easiest Dorito one to to find. The what well, here's what was the giveaway for me. Uh was the Crunchwrap Supreme, it was the tortilla. It's the only one with this particular soft tortilla, and I that was a dead giveaway. The two that were hard to pick out were right. these two. They're the, they're this. I, but there they're is the a sauce on the Mexican pizza that is not on the nachos. Okay. And there's also a different kind of cheese. Link, I have great news. It is the quesadilla round. Yes. yes. And you know what? I completely agree with you. Quesadilla is the best thing on the menu. Chicken. Chicken oh, quesadilla. You guys are going to really love this round then because excluding the breakfast menu, Taco Bell offer, offers three kinds of quesadillas, cheese, chicken, and steak. Mm-hmm. The question is, can you really taste the difference between the two meat options? So your job is to tell me which one has chicken okay. in it. Well, okay. I think this should be easy. Well. But they wouldn't have done it if it was going to be super easy, all right? All right, all right, all right. But do they know who they're dealing with? <laughs> <laughs> okay, We're here's show them. the first quesadilla. Oh. Huh. Hmm. Mm-hmm. I was expecting something else. That's why. What? I thought it was going to be a spoon. And then when I I opened up my mouth and it was more than a spoon and it didn't have an end. It just kept going and I realized it was okay. a whole quesadilla. Yeah. Um, my brain did a little trick on me and now I'm lost. Oh, really? I feel like I need a, another bite. <laughs> okay, well, that's quite a build up. All you had to do is ring the bell. Okay, you ready for- You think for... you know what you just tasted? Yeah. Me too, but I, now I'm, I'm just all discombobulated. All right. Taco Bell. Here's the second quesadilla. Mm. <laughs> mm. Nice. You hungry? What are you doing over there? Really, really thinking. I think this. I think this one is is uh, easy. It's not. Listen, even a Taco Bell genius will tell you this isn't easy. Wow, interesting. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a three, two, one. You're gonna tell me which one was chicken, and your options are one or two. <laughs> <laughs> yep. okay. We're smart. Here we go. Three, two, one. Two. two. 
Uh, clearly, though. Clearly. Okay. Both said two? Yeah. yeah. I don't know if I'm right or not. Well, he, here's the thing is that um, it, we wanted to make it a truly blind taste test. So what we did was we didn't feed you guys the same one at the same time. So the thing is, is that Rhett, you are right, and Link, you are wrong. <laughs> Y'all are awesome. I don't understand. And I'm okay. How do you not understand? She, I, she could just could, she fully explained it. Like, it how was, can I don't it understand was, how it could be it wrong? Was pristine. Oh, you what did I eat? You, hold on. What do you not understand? What she said? Or what, what did I? What you, I ate? You you, you, you did the same thing in a different order. I did I eat? My ate? two was your one, and your one was my two, man. But I, my, my, my number two was chicken. That no. was beef. That was steak. Your number two was steak, Link. But Rhett's number two was chicken. <laughs> and let me tell you, as a taco, as a certified Taco Bell genius, <laughs> it was not as easy as I made it look. I, it, there was a moment there where I was unsure of myself. And it wasn't as easy as I said it was. And when Link agreed with me, I was even more unsure of myself. <laughs> Do you know what this means? This is crazy. Yeah, Link thinks steak is beef. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> no, it means that Taco Bell tastes the same. <laughs> you may have noticed that we have new bells, but have you also noticed that we have new mugs? Yes. They're, sweater they're weather big. mug. These are perfect for wearing a sweater, maybe making some hot cocoa. You get your little cozy Randler on there with his turtleneck. I bet you know where you can get it. Can you talk about it in a way that makes me want to buy it? <laughs> Why don't you give it a shot? Now at mythical.com, the sweater metal. <laughs> Good. There the you sweater go. weather mug. 15 ounces of pleasure in your mouth. Uh, I, I didn't prepare for this. I didn't know I was gonna have to do it. Hey man. It's a great mug. Get it. Mythical.com, it's it is a beautiful mug. Uh, it'll get you in the, the sweater weather war vibe. Yep. Yes. <laughs> now what, Stevie? Okay. I feel jilted. Yeah. So you're about to taste two different burritos from the Taco Bell menu. Okay. And after tasting both, you're gonna take off your blindfolds and you're gonna write down up to three differences you tasted between oh. the two burritos. I like this. You can get three points. One point for each uh, thing. I don't Up really know what we'll do with the points necessarily, but points are fun, and Up to that's what it's about. Yeah, you can. Yeah, three differences. All right, here we go. I'm ready. Okay, here's your first burrito. Oh, I really wish my wife was here. First of all, I just need moral support. I need somebody on my team. Second of all, that woman loves Taco Bell. I don't. I do, that's, she's an enigma. I'm gonna ring the bell, but that's not. That's for the other burrito. Well, okay. All right, and burrito number two. <laughs> that was hard. Have you already tasted the second burrito? No. no. But well, then what's hard about it? <laughs> okay. I, I need to start writing, but I'll keep my blindfold on. Because I know that Rhett's not ready, and I don't want to forget. Okay, we can hide the burrito so you can take your blindfolds off. Okay, thank you. I've lost it. I know, it's a lot. The streak is over. Uh. <laughs> I All think right. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Except I'm writing one more thing. All right, I'm ready. Who's going first? Whoever, just go ahead. You can't change your answer. Okay. Well, I, I think that the first one, no, this is the first one. I had it. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is the second one. So, the first one had beans and cheese and it was cooler. And the second one had meat and it had a hard shell inside. Oh, I didn't get that. And then it was hotter. <laughs> so maybe I might be able to explain some of those differences, I think. Because I thought that the first one had beans 
And yeah. I thought it right. also had rice. <laughs> um, and I tasted nacho cheese and jalapenos, but it may have just been one or the other. There was no meat in the first one, and there was meat in the second one. Okay, so here's the thing. The first burrito you had was the Beefy Crunch burrito, which had beef, rice, nacho cheese, sour cream, Fritos Flamin' Hot Fiesta strips, and beans. 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 And then the second one was the Beefy Melt burrito, which had beef, rice, nacho cheese, sour cream, three cheese blend, and regular Fiesta strips. So really the only difference that you both pointed out is the beans? Oh, I said nacho cheese. But they both have nacho cheese. But it does have nacho cheese. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. It's over what, for you. What makes it hot, though? Because Link said well, it was the hotter. Second, I just the, meant the, temperature hot. The first one, oh. yeah. The first one, I guess should be hotter because it has Fritos Flamin' Hot Fiesta Strips and the second one just had Fiesta Strips. Uh, I, so what you're saying is that we only got one, we both got the same thing right and that's, we both knew that there was beans in the first one. Yeah. It's the only thing that we did correctly. Well, what yeah. we've proven is that it all tastes the same. No, we haven't. You've proven it all tastes the same for you. <laughs> we got handbell choir. That's how you do it. And then you have to wait. You can be that sad person with the note that never gets hit in the song and you're just like waiting. Waiting. I mean there's people who sometimes they only they only they only get to do one dong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially the guy with the biggest bell. Right. Maybe yeah, end of the thing. Yeah. <laughs> you are going to taste a selection of sauces aside from the hot sauce packets that Taco Bell has. Oh. What? And what? There's other sauces? Yeah, they have a, a, a many a sauce outside. Uh, but in order to find out just how distinct all of these sauces really are, you must identify how many different sauces you actually tasted. So I'm going to give you a lineup, and then you're going to tell me how many different sauces you tasted. Oh, God. Here we go. First sauce. Yeah. Ew, not not good on its own. Second. Oh dang, that's hot. Okay, that's different. Sauce no, number three. Almost juicy. Also spicy. Uh -huh. I, I need that one again. I don't want it again. Okay. Okay. Sauce number four. Okay. Okay. Sauce number five. Oh. <laughs> Don't make more mouth noises than we're already making. We're losing viewers left and right. <laughs> Don't add more noises. All right. Okay. Sauce number six. Repetition much? Seven. Okay. Eight. How many are there? I can't I can't go on like this. <laughs> Twenty and nine. God, so many of them were mayonnaise. Like, mayonnaise-based sauces, God. Okay, do you have your answers of how many sauces you think you had? Yeah, can I take my blindfold off? Yeah, you can take your blindfold off. I'm gonna give you a three, two, one. Okay. Three, yeah. two, one. Six. Five. Five. You had eight sauces. <laughs> Really? Wow. Yep, you had chipotle sauce, red sauce, creamy jalapeno sauce, chipotle sauce again. Yeah, I, I, so far that was completely on track. Nacho cheese sauce, mm -hmm. avocado ranch, yes, Mexican pizza sauce, 
Oh, this is when I started getting up. How? What number did you give? Six. Six. Yeah. It, all the sauce. There's there's only five sauces. Sour cream. Sour cream <laughs> and was spicy obviously ranch. new. Right. So I wouldn't really call it a sauce. A but. couple of the ones that had the chili powder in them ended up feeling <clears throat> like they were the same sauce. But I mean. I was more right than you. I'm a little. I, I mean, th there's more distinction than you thought there was. I, you know, I, I, it's all the same. I assert it. I stand by it. But I don't think that's what we learned today. I think we learned that it's kind of the same. But if you really think about it, it's also kind of pretty different. Okay. All right. That's the new slogan coming in 2024. <laughs> Taco Bell. It's kind, kind of, of the, the same, same. But, but if you really think about it, it's kind of sort of a little bit different. 2024. Excuse me while I go Hershey squirt. <laughs> Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hey, hey Red and Link. Link. I'm Audrey. And I'm JP. And, and this, this is, is the world's, world's most chippiest chip. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. <laughs> I, I, I see what you're saying. I love it when a couple's on the same page. I get it. I totally get it. Click the top link to watch us determine the strongest tortilla chip in good middle of the morning. And if I don't know where the is gonna land. The weather outside may be frightful, but this mug is so delightful. Shop the new sweater weather mug available now at mythical.com.